Sorry, guys. I had my mic off. I was talking for six minutes without with having my mic muted. Sorry about that. Uh, but welcome back. Pretty much, uh, we're here facing off against Team Galactic, and we're going up against the other grunt. So, completely sorry about having my mic off. It was just pure silence. But uh, today, we're trying to get to Eterna City, and then next video will probably be taking on the gym battle at gym at Eterna City. So that's nice. Last video, my Chimchar involved into a Monferno, and I also acquired Mew and Jirachi. And if you were paying attention in the beginning, you'll notice that I punched in a code, which was uh, BDSP, Brilliant Diamond, Shining Pearl, and then Underground with the O as a zero in order to get uh, the starter statues, which I can place into my secret base once I acquire that. So yeah, there was that. I complete, st truly apologize for not realizing I had a... Uh, I had my mic muted for seven, six, seven minutes straight. I didn't realize till now. Sorry about that, but yeah. Right now we're pretty much going through Eterna City. Uh, oh, what's this thing? They seem to have forgotten it. It's a works key. It must be for Val the w Valley Wind Works. It's of no use to me. You may as well have it. You obtained the works key. All right, so pretty much that key will open the door to the building we ended the video off yesterday with that t grunt battle. Thank you. You surely saved me. Those goons were trying to rob me of my sweet, sweet honey. They sure were weird, though. You saw how they were dressed. What they were saying did not make didn't make a whole lot of lot of sense either. Oh, I need to thank you. Will you take this as my thanks? Got a honey, sweet. But yeah, uh, for today's video will be fairly short, thirty minutes to depending on how far we get, but let's just explore this area a bit more. See what's in this house. Breaking and entering, breaking and entering. Not much. The flowers that grow in the fields here are special. Do you see how they're more vivid than flowers elsewhere in Sinnoh? You can thank Pokemon for that. Okay, so pretty much this area was just to get the key not too sure if any wild Pokemon spawn here are here, but there's a sweet scent in the air. Slathered the bark with honey. The bark was slathered with honey. Alright, so I'm not too sure if Pokemon will spawn here, but maybe let's give it like two minutes. And, but yeah, so pretty much if... Uh, I'll repeat what I said earlier because I had my mic muted, but I am pretty much going to be, next video I'll be entering, taking on the Eterna City Gym. If we can make it to the city by the, today, the end of today's video, I'll probably make it a bit longer to make up for the six to seven minutes of me being silent. Yeah, I don't think, uh, I don't think uh, any Pokemon will spawn here quickly but let me just check my back to see if I still have that honey nope don't that's a well I just lost some honey but who cares I really never used honey in any any time I acquired it so not a loss for me not a gain either so there's that but let's head back to the Windworks Valley but all, for today's video, pretty much, uh, like I said, repeated a lot, we'll be yang to Eterna City, and then next video, I'll be having my roommate Calvin join me for the video, and it'll be an hour long with him, so we'll get you'll get your two-person commentary there, but again, sadly, the, I can't get the audio to work, so I'll be talking a lot. I do apologize, truly. What? No, wait. You have the key? Locking the door was meaningless. I am the loser in this, after all. This is no time for self-pity. I got to alert the commander. Alright. Let's just check this way. 
Anything? Box? No? All right. And we're going to be taking on a lot of grunts, so I'm not sure if we'll make it to Eternity today. Who knows? All right. Let's see. Cascoon. All right. Yeah. But I truly apologize for not noticing. My mic was muted. I mute my mic before starting to record in case, like, I accidentally hit the record button and anything picks up. But, yeah. Uh... But yeah, pretty much my roommate Calvin will be joining next video. It will be hour long. I'll be recording it tonight with him because I won't have time to record tomorrow. So yeah, but I hope you guys do enjoy this video and please like and subscribe if uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more. I'll be recording Pokemon Brilliant Diamond till it is completed. Uh, let's just take this grunt on instead of wasting time going the other way but yeah um i will uh try all when the weekend happens i'm pretty much gonna be uploading like super probably super long videos not too sure but i will be getting a lot of a lot longer videos out during then i hope you guys will watch them even though it's not live or recorded i still would appreciate if you guys just watched even a quarter of the video, so keep. So yeah, um, a lot. I will pretty much uh, mock punch. Uh, I will appreciate as many as much support as you guys will give. I do hope you enjoy these videos. Leave a like and comment, Calvin. My roommate Countin does like to ask questions to you guys, and if you like, go ahead and answer them. Mute roots level ten. Well, amnesia, nice. But yeah, um, if you do want to see, you can go ahead and watch the previous epi episode to see how he is. And honestly, you could even tell us if you want have anything to talk. Oh, I, re I remember her from the anime. I forgot her name. I'm one of Team Galactic's, Galactic's three commanders. We've been trying to create a new world that's better than this one, but people have shown little understanding about what we do. You don't understand either, do you? It's just a little saddening. So let's have a battle to decide what we should do next. If I win, you leave. If we win, or if you win, we Team Galactic will leave. All right, so pretty much, uh, I guess, mini boss battle. Commander Mars, that's her. Because I know all the Team Galactic's uh, commanders are named after pl the planets. I just forget which one's which. But I guess Mars because of her red hair. Ember? Yeah. All right. Astonish. Oop. What do you think you're doing to my Pokemon? I don't know what she means by that. I'm just battling like normal. Hitting it with a number. But yeah. Uh, so let's just see how far we get. Even though I say my goal is to get to Eternity by the end of today's video. Who knows? Plans change on the fly. So, And do note that this is a Perugly. Uh, I remember this Pokemon. But yeah, uh, but I do hope you guys uh, enjoy the raw footage I do. I will try and get into some editing at some point, but that's if this channel can grow a bit more. But I will try and edit once I have more free time on my hands. But did it just eat? Orange berry. Okay. I really never used berries, so had had them given to my pokemon so really didn't know what it looked like but power up punch scratch Ooh, wow wow all right one more hit and uh, that'll be it mock punch 
that's game. That's the match. All right. But yeah, uh, if you guys have any like Pokemon requests, like on in terms of uh, adding to the team, I gladly will look at those comments. So please share them down below. But I will pretty much my final lineup will always be my starter. I'll probably have Mew and Abra, two psychic types. And uh, I'll probably, I'll try and get pseudo-legendary Gibble and evolve it into a Garchomp. So yeah, and then I'll probably chuck in Dialga too. Not too sure, depending on how it is, but most likely I'll have Dialga in the deck team up. Even though not many people will keep a legendary, depending on stats. That's alright though, I quite enjoyed our battle. I guess it's time to say goodbye and leave for the time being. Team Galactic, they were saying they had gathered to gather Pokemon and energy no matter what. It was for creating a new universe or so they claimed. Nothing they said made any sort of sense to me. Anyway, I can't tell you how grateful I am to you for saving me. I can finally see my little daughter again. Oh. Papa! Yuck, Papa, you're stinky. Go shower now, stinky. Oh, sorry. Uh, they had me working non-stop. Thank you, trainer. You made those bad people go away. I think the balloon Pokemon will come visiting again. Balloon Pokemon? So I guess Drift Balloon, maybe? But let's get out of here and see if we can continue on from that bridge that we could not go earlier when I had my mic off. But yeah, we can go ahead. Oh, all right. Let's take on this trainer. Camper Jacob. All right. Wait, I probably, I should head back and heal up my Pokemon first. Before I go heal up, heal up uh, Monferno before anything else. Critical, nice. Yeah. Since you lose one Pokemon, this will be fairly quick. That'll do it. Ponyta fainted. Yeah. Hmm. Alright. I do hope to get Abra. I'm not too sure if Abra... When I caught Abra, he had the his Twisted Spooner, I believe. But let me just... Uh, if I can get that, I'll give it to him, but usually Abra, it's like 10% chance they'll have a spoon with them, no matter which evolution of Abra it is. So just be mindful of that if you do plan to get Abra, but yesterday, in yesterday's video, we found out about his teleport ability, so that'll be useful. So I mean, I replaced uh, my, when I got Mew, I sent my Starly to the box, so... Hopefully, Abra can be a good substitute in place of my regional bird. Because, I mean, in Pixelmon, I believe Abra is fairly powerful. So, hopefully, he's just as powerful in the game. But let's just see. Oh. Who do we have here? Weasel. I may catch Weasel because he's a water type. And water types may come in handy. Because I'm probably... Not going to uh, have the Manaphy Tail Whip. Defense fell. Let's try a Pokeball. One, two, three, cut. Yep. But I will be keeping the Manaphy a part of my team until it hatches and then I'll swap it out um, Pokemon to swap out for Weasel added all right I'll add him to party and uh, I know bit of I'll swap him out for bit of I just hope I could still use a rock smash which we can test technically oh all right, another Buizel. 
All right. Power up punch. All right, let's just head back to the cave to see if I can still use Rock Smash. Otherwise, I may uh, keep the Bidoof in place of another Pokemon of mine. So, who knows? Flame Wheel? Oh, yes. Yes. Let us get, get a Flame Wheel. Flame Wheel's 60. Yeah, replace Scratch. Yes. Two fighting moves, two fire type moves. That's good, because usually I may get rid of all my... Uh, all my normal moves. Heck, I even had one of my Pokemon maintain a uh, Ember throughout the entire game. One of my uh, Fire type starters. I literally had it retain Ember. So there is that. But uh, yeah, let's head down to the cave here to see if I can still use Rock Smash without Bidoof. It would be nice. That would be nice. Since yes. Sweet. Okay, so it's just a wild Bidoof that pops up. Alright. It doesn't necessarily have to be my Bidoof. Alright, and I just now realized I did not have my Poketch out. So, let's just pop that out. And then dash all the way up. Let me heal up that Buizel too. Heal, yes. Take a few seconds, yeah. Even though none of my, I hardly ever use my other Pokemon, but ah, who knows. But let us check, oop, not that, X, Pokemon, Weasel, check summary. What moves, tackle, okay. Not that much, but uh, Hold on, let's check its uh, Jolly. All right. Uh, special attack down, speed up. That's good. Stat in the boost the Pokemon speed in the rain. Not bad. All right, yeah. I can run with this Weasel. I'll just have to make sure it levels up to get water type moves sometime, at some point. So let's continue on our journey. Try and get to turn a city. And it's already the 24 minute mark, so. Ah. X attack, all right. All right. There's no mountain here, but I'm dressed to hike. Gahaha. Let us begin. Hike your Daniel. Geodude. And as you guys know, I do play MTG Magic the Gathering. And I did order cards for Black Friday, so I will be uh, doing a video on those once I get my house from uh, from taking my finals at college. Because once I'm done with my finals, I start my winter break. So do look out for that because do look out for that video. But it'll take some time, mainly because they'll be arriving December 10th, from what I know. But I won't be be. Uh, or it's not December 10th, but this Friday. But uh, I won't be getting I won't be getting home till December my last final, which is on a Monday, two weeks from now. So uh, mock punch. So I mean, it'll be some time, but hopefully, once I do, I can upload a video about that. I did. I am trying to make an Ur Dragon deck, so. Hopefully the cards I got are fairly good. Geodude, keep. But I mean, honest opinion, I I don't I won't hesitate. I will take harsh criticism. I don't care. I'm used to it. So if you have any suggestions for that in an Ur Dragon Commander deck, go for it. I don't care the cost. So I mean, I'll look up the card to see if I it work, would work well with me. If not, I won't. But I will appreciate your comments either way. So do comment. And I'll see what I can do with it. <sighs> Sorry about that. Just had to get a drink of water. So 
Boys to 11. All right. Hopefully, quick attack. All right. Another normal type move. Hopefully, he can learn a water type move naturally. 616. All right. But let's see. Abra. Sweet. Abra is evolving. All right. If I remember, it wasn't Alakazam. Or Abra Kadabra, Abra Kadabra Alakazam. All right, height and weight. All right, confusion. Sweet, that's good. All right, let's just see. Trainer tips: Items placed in your bag are automatically sorted, but. To the appropriate pocket. Okay, that's just literally my bag. This trainer. It's a long way between Floroma Town and Eternity City, so let's battle. Alright? So, I mean, I guess we won't be making it to Eternity City this video, sadly, but at least we can try and make it halfway. I'll decide to go, to, what, to 40, 45 minute video today, just to make up for that lost time of I'm. But I do hope you guys enjoy the. My commentary on the game and anything else that I decide to go over. But yeah. Sadly, I cannot get background music, so hopefully this will make up for it. I don't know what is going on. I have the Razor Ripsaw capture card. But uh, even Razor's website does not help. So I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's my system. Maybe it's the capture card itself. Or my... The connection it has to my switch, but I don't know, because I'm able to get a uh, Bluetooth audio headphones with it. So, oh, so yeah, but I guess today we'll be taking on a lot of trainers. Aroma Lady Elizabeth, a Badoo. I'll December this. Badoos are super easy. I just love seeing a Badoo and just hitting it, hitting it with a number. Oh, wow. This was not a one-hit KO. That sucks. Worry Seed. Blaze, Monferno, Insomnia. Monferno acquired Insomnia. All right. Uh, hopefully that, yep, that Ember will hit. The Insomnia did not set in yet, which is good. X. All right, no level ups, but that's totally cool. Level ups do take time. Did you understand what I meant? Did my Pokemon smell nice? Seven hundred twenty-eight Poke dollars. Sweet. But yeah, uh, let's just see what there else there is around here. What is the? Oh, it's a vent that exchanges air from the air from the Grand Underground. All right, let's catch get this Poke Ball. Found a, it was a literal Pokeball. All okay. right, but how much? How many Pokeballs do I even have technically? Because uh, seventeen remaining. All right. Yeah, all right. I have to cross the bridge, and then I'll take on this trainer here before heading up that bridge. Let's see. Sienna, Sienna Shinx, all right. Monferno, I know you can do it. Hopefully that insomnia does not make my Monferno go to sleep. Ember, almost, bite, yeah. Battle, mock punch. All right, Shinx fainted. Pachirisu. Uh, keep, I'll keep my current, mainly because Weasel's water type, so not that effective. And also all the, Monferno is certainly my highest level Pokemon. 
But I mean, that's mainly because he does most of the fighting, so he gets most of the XP, and then all the other Pokemon kind of, it just get it's a mixture of, like, how it's distributed, power punch. So yeah. But I do like the XP share sometimes, mainly because it makes leveling up other Pokemon easier. You just need to have one super powerful one, and then you just kind of grind with using that Pokemon while all you make let all your other Pokemon gain levels. Weasel to level 12. Picnic or Sienna. Sienna. Alright. So let us head back. Oh, I don't I don't understand why that's there then. Cross the bridge. Take it on this hiker. Of all places possible. I lost my way here. Alright. So. Hiker Nicholas. Who knows how far we'll get. But I will be ending the video at the 40 minute mark. So. An Onyx. Alright. If Weasel had a water type move. That would surely be useful. But fighting type moves are just as good. Alright. Attack Rose. Rock throw. Ooh. I do true honestly, I like the animations of some of the Pokemon moves. Mainly because like compared to the old games, there weren't that many. Mainly there were more pixel pixel style, except like Stealth Rock. Mainly because Stealth Rock, it's literally spikes just being chucked from the Pokemon using the move onto your the opposing Pokemon's uh, side. So I mean that's fairly that's pretty cool. And then they just disappear to blend in. Alright. Repel. That's good. That'll come in handy later if I'm just trying to move quickly. Alright. Get her to cha challenge me. Battle girl Kelsey. Alright. No, I did not know there was this type of trainer, a battle girl. Hmm. Mainly because I'm I never played a Pokemon Diamond or Pokemon Pearl before. Mainly because I did not one I did not own a DS and two, I was a little kid so I really did not understand what Pokemon was other than it was cool anime to watch during my time. So, Mock Power Up Punch. But yeah. So, I mean, since Cal Calvin's not here today, I'll probably give the question, uh, what's your favorite legendary or mythic type Pokemon? Mine, legendary-wise, would be Mewtwo, and then mythic, Arceus. I mean, it's nothing special, but just because. Alright, another small trainer. But yeah. Alright, Picnicker. That's what they are. They kind of look like they're in Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts, depending on which one it was. A Piplup. Alright. Though she has the type advantage, I pretty much have a level advantage. But... Yeah, technically you could maintain a Pokemon at their base, just repeatedly pressing B. Because my Monferno up leveled up last video towards the beginning, so he was probably level like between 15 to 18 when uh, he leveled up, I believe. So, yeah. Or even a bit 14 maybe. So, I mean, yeah. But I do hope you guys also enjoyed my this clear audio because I'm using my a Razer mic in place my Razer Siren X mic in place of the laptop mic. Uh, let's see what these guys. Do you think you can get through Eternal Farness by yourself? All right. So I guess there's nothing here. You seem to be a bit tired. Rest a while. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So that just heals up my Pokemon too. Sweet. You and your Pokemon look completely refreshed. All right, let's get out of here. I can head down here. 
super potion, all right? And then just going down a bit more, that should be where I was at before. So they can't go that way, but uh, let me just see if there's anything. I turn a forest. I would need to use cut for that, which I do not possess. So I guess I will be leaving the forest. Wait, I'll head back to see if that was a trainer or not. Or just a NPC with dialogue. Many poison type Pokemon make Eternal Forest their home. But I didn't buy any antidotes. What should I do? Do I press on or do I go back? Press on! Fight. I po have my Pokemon fight through the poison. Oh. Hello, my, my name's Cheryl. And you are? Okay, so your name is Saga. I'm sincere sincerely glad to meet you. Saga, may I ask you a big favor? I want you to get through this forest, but I'm afraid of doing it alone. I've heard that there's a sinister group of people called Team Galactic. I think they'll, there'll be, sa be safety in numbers. Please may I go with you? You decide to go with Cheryl. All right. I do. I'll keep your Pokemon in perfect health. All right. So pretty much get companion along the way. We're turn of forest where time stands still. All right. So I mean, if I check the map... Yeah, I'm pretty much here. Turn forest, thick stand tree. So turn turn a city is fairly close. Farther down. Oh, but let's. I guess I I'll end the video off with after this Sukun and Baneri battle. Jancy, all right. Flame wheel on the Sukun. All right, XP, and then once the Baneri is defeated, I get I'll be getting a bit more XP from that. All right, power, power up punch. Yep, that'll do it. All right, Weasel. All right, so I guess we'll just end the video here today. I mean, we got a companion, and then we're pretty much between me and Eterna City is the Eternal Forest, so we'll continue next tomorrow's video off from here. Hope you guys enjoy. See you next time.